Before this video starts, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon, and let's get into the video. What's up, Taz? My name is and today we're back. We're in the Discord of YBA, okay? We're gonna be looking at a little bit of uh, some new updates. So, without further ado, let's just hop right into it so first of all we have time skip for king crimson uh king crimson requiem the world the world alternate universe star platinum and star platinum the world basically every stand that can do time stop in general no longer stops you from running so when you go for that time stop it's not gonna stop you from running and then you're gonna go super slow um you're gonna be still running I mean, it made sense, but they were just trying not to make it too OP, I guess. Um, so, you can't run anymore while you're in actual time stop. Uh, or, well, yeah, you can't run in time stop, but that's not what I went. What I meant was, after you uh, do a time skip, you can still run after you've done it. Um, they said it can't be spammed. That can mean a lot of things. That can mean either they made a new update or something and it can't be spammed as much or they made the cooldown a little bit longer so it is not spammable as it was before all right and then now we have the biggest update out of all of the time skip area and that is it will still teleport you even if your cursor is out of range so that is pretty big okay that is pretty big because basically what happens is you cannot time stop to somewhere where your mouse is not in range where you can actually reach so you'd be spamming it and you'd have to get it to the range and it kind of wastes your time a little bit and you kind of can get punched or you're you're just way open for an attack so that that helps a lot now a few questions i have for this is does this apply to vertical teleporting like time skip vertically it's like if i were to point my cursor in the air will it teleport me into the air and then i drop down or is there like a height limit that's what i'm wondering and we're gonna test that out because i'm gonna hop in game i have the world uh alternate universe so we're gonna test that out once i actually get in game hopefully i still have it i hope i i hope i do anyway uh, let's go to the next update so next we have adjusted how many points you gain slash lose in a 1v1 match towards ranking so uh basically it, you don't lose or gain as much or maybe you gain or lose more who knows they didn't really say it just says adjusted how many points you gain or lose so it could be either one um they boosted it or they nerfed it who knows um next we have 1v1 and sbr ranks can now go up to 100 it used to be 50 so that means 50 more people will be on the leaderboard rank um, I'm not sure if they get a prize or anything. I'm not sure if they even started the prize thing again. Um, but yeah, now 100 people will be showed. Uh, next, we have made it harder to glitch in and out of the 1v1 map. I never tried glitching out of the 1v1 map or do any glitches in general because it's supposed to be a 1v1. Or maybe they mean not as purposely glitching it, but they mean as in you're trying to fight and then you glitch out and then you're under the map or you're in the wall or something like that who knows it could be either one it could be both but now they made it harder to glitch out or in so yeah and then next we have you can also view the specific points of a ranked person in the 1v1 and sbr ranked leaderboards so um now you can see someone's uh rank when you're in a 1v1 or sbr and you'll be like okay that guy's uh, number one maybe i shouldn't do this maybe i should just alt f4 that's what I'm going to do. Um, next, we have... You can not... You now cannot boxing fist barrage right after stand barraging. Oh, wow. That was actually a pretty OP combination. I wonder what the cooldown is for that. Because that was kind of what made boxing boxing besides the HP and defense. I wonder how long the cooldown is. Maybe like one second. I think one second would be enough of a cooldown. Because it still has to have that like right after, you know? But who knows? 
uh, we'll find out eventually. Um, but next we have White Snake Pilot Mode is now like Silver Chariot's, Chariot's Pilot, but with range. But with a range? Wait, so did White Snake have infinite range? Or what does that mean? White Snake Pilot Mode is now like Silver Chariot's Pilot, but with a. Oh, oh, okay, I get it now. Okay, so they mean Silver Chariot's Pilot, as in it doesn't fly. Okay, that kind of nerfed it a lot because the flying pilot is really, really OP. So now instead of flying, White Snake um, just walks. I actually really want to see what that looks like because I don't. I doubt it's gonna have the same animation because uh, Silver Chariot has like a specific animation like towards the anime and how it walked. So I doubt it has the same animation. If it does, I'm gonna be really mad. But uh, I wonder what animation it will have. I really wonder. So we'll see that when we get in game. But last thing, new rank game modes, 2v2. So yeah, you can now 2v2 or 1v1 and you get ranked for that. So uh, now that we've gone over all those updates, let's go ahead, hop ourselves in game and check these fix. I cannot speak. Check these physical updates out for ourselves. We're not going to do all the like 2v2s and stuff like that um, and checking ranks. Maybe we'll see somebody in game with the rank and make it see. But if not, oh well. Um, we are going to check out the time stop update. We're going to look a little bit at that. And then we're also going to look at White Snake's pilot mode. I really want to see what animation they used for the actual pilot. It's going to be really, really cool because. Oh, Coliseum. It's going to be really, really cool because it's uh, not going to be the same. Or at least I hope. It really should not be. I'd be very, very disappointed. So I don't have uh, White Snake myself. Um. Pretty sure somebody else has it, but uh, here's the world alternate universe. We're gonna switch on to that, and then we're gonna upgrade so that we can get time skip. And after we get time skip, then we shall go ahead and test the verticality on the actual stamp. So that shall be nice. And let's go ahead. And, I think it's here. Time. Where's time skip? It's here, right? No. No. This. No. Where's, where's time skip at? I, I probably skipped it, honestly. Pocket Revolver, Instant Rage, Time Stop, Angry Issues. Does this not? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Okay. Boom. Bam. I feel like I skipped over it. If I skipped over it, please don't flame me in the comments. I, I wear glasses, and I'm not wearing them right now. I'm pretty blind. So, yeah. Um. Now, let's go ahead and test this out. So, this is what it looks like, first of all, without going vertical. It just said you go forward. Okay, so nice. Nice. It, it still time skipped me. So basically, you don't have to point like right at the ground where it's closest. Um, you can just point that way and it'll bring you all the way over there. But this is the true test. Let's see if it brings you into the air. Because that is a whole different question. And that is very, very sick if it does. Let's see. It does. It does. That is actually pretty cool. So basically, if you combine that with a stand jump, you can get on top like stuff which is pretty cool um so yeah uh the box is a little bit small it's smaller than i imagined it was the little ball it's a ball by the way but i mean i guess it's not bad but yeah that is a new time skip update that's a lot better than it used to be and then now let's go see if we can find someone with white snake if we cannot then oh well it's fine we'll find it another day but let's go ahead and get to searching all right so this guy has white snake we're gonna see what the pilot mode looks like. All right, and then I gotta give this guy a screenshot. He's at the uh, arcade. Okay, all right. Let's go give this guy a screenshot while he resets. We gotta go fast though. There's not much time. We do not have much time left. Okay, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Is it this guy? Yes, it is. Hello. Hello, good sir. Screenshot, yes. All right. Let's go ahead and give him a little nice pose. By the way, public service announcement. No one can have the same name, okay? On Roblox. No one can have the... Oh, there's the animation. That's what it looks like. That is a pretty... That is a pretty epic animation. Not gonna lie. I really like that. That is nice. I love the little menacing run, you know? Or the little, or an epic run, who knows? So yeah, um, that guy got a screenshot. 
Hopefully he has a good day. That is pretty epic. I love the new pilot mode. Uh, yeah, that is pretty much it. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you did, make sure to give this video a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later in the next video slash stream. Peace.